Okay, Steve back again here in WinJupos. I've already made my three measurement files, but there's one thing I want to show you before, uh, before I go on to the next step. I mean, it would become really obvious to you very quickly, as it did to me, but, um, and there may be a, a workaround or a way to get around this, but um, I mentioned in uh, PixInsight, you know, the fact that I rotated my image 180 degrees to get the, uh, the north pole up. Um, and the reason that is is if you don't have the north pole up to match here when you uh, derotate um, you'll just end up with a blurry mess um, and you can kind of see um, if I open up right now I've got the uh, first image loaded and if I open up the uh, last one if you watch you'll be able to see the, the great red spot shift You see a jump. Um, so it needs to know the correct uh, rotation. Um, maybe if, if you were, probably I guess if you just rotated this to match, it probably would work right. I actually haven't tried it, but uh, I did uh, try and derotate uh, images with uh, South Pole up here and it doesn't work out at all. So, um, all right, so now we're ready to uh, derotate. We're going to go over here to Tools and derotation of images. Um, you're going to use this with color images. If you were doing monochrome images, you would use um, this, the derotation of RGB frames. Um, it's a few more steps to do each of the, uh, you would do like three red, three green, three blue, and do, actually you would do the steps here, just as we're doing for each of the three channels, and then when you wanted to combine them all, you would use these. Um, maybe I'll make a video of that someday. So we get over here. Now we have to load our, our measurements. And I'm going to add those. And pick the three measurement files. And you can make a few adjustments. You can make the final image size bigger. Sometimes if you've got a moon in here, it'll cut it off and make that a little bigger to get it included. You can choose your uh, output format. Choose north or south of the top. And when you got all those things set, you just say compile image. And there is the uh, three images derotated and stacked. Um, and from there, we can move back to uh, Pixinsight to work on this image a little bit more.